Yes. Um, now, I want to ask you as well, this time last year, it was it was tough, you know, this, this debate that was going on in the media. And I wanted to ask you, you know, you've been here for several years now, you have Albanian friends, Albanian colleagues. How was it for you trying to deal with that? I mean, I'm talking about the rhetoric in the British media, you know, it was very harsh. Um, it was very harsh towards Albanians. How did that make you feel? How did you deal with that on a personal level as well? So, look, I mean, obviously, as you say, um, it's been a difficult uh, summer last summer. Um, what I'm really pleased about is through the joint efforts um, by the two governments, but also the communities, we've really been able to turn around yes. the situation. Um, the Albanian community in the UK, the large proportion are um, uh, there legally contributing to British society. I've been talking to Albanian professors who are leading uh, the way on uh, university partnerships and academic excellence. I've been talking to businessmen. I've been talking to others uh, in the UK, uh, school teachers, a whole right range of professionals um, who are a fundamental part of uh, yes. British uh, society. We need to nurture that. We need to intensify those uh, links and that will, I think, be a really important part of the future relationships between um, the UK and Albania. Um, but there was a problem, including um, harsh rhetoric, um, there was discriminatory language uh, used in the media, and that's not something um, that uh, we wish to see against any community. No. Um, and so, you know, one of the things that Britain is known for is its approach to tolerance and acceptance and inclusion. And we want to make sure that Albanians, just as any other community or, or minority, are treated fairly, justly, and equally, uh, and that's the approach that we'll continue to take. So I've definitely, on a personal basis as ambassador, really made sure that I've highlighted these issues where they've mm -hmm. occurred um, and put those uh, into um, uh, the relevant uh, parts of the British system. Um, and what I'm really pleased to see is that clearly, you know, the government has clearly focused on, you know, we must focus on the positives, we must address any issues, uh, and then move forward in collaboration. And what I'm delighted about now one year on from our joint communique uh, last December, we're really seeing this joint operational collaboration uh, move into its next mode. I mean, Albania is now our best partner internationally, our best partner operationally, um, and we've really had an extraordinary impact in both countries through this joint yes. collaboration.